Hi guys, Matt Cook here with Humminbird. Uh, we're in northern Minnesota today chasing some basin crappies. And uh, one little tip that I want to show you guys for better uh, marking those schools of fish that are coming up really tightly stacked together is a feature called A-scope. And uh, really what A-scope is going to do is rather than take those tight flat lines all stacked together, it's going to round them off. And so each of those marks you'll be able to better identify as individual fish and your bait within that fish school. So how you change your, either your flasher wheel or 2D sonar to A-scope is very simple. Um, right now our active screen is on our flasher wheel. We're gonna tap menu here. And we're gonna scroll down here to our flasher style. And from there, we're just gonna flip that right over to A-scope. And if I pull this jig up here on our flasher wheel, you'll notice it's kind of rounded off. So if a fish were to come right up to that jig, um, we're gonna have little black edges right here where our jig is rounded off. We're gonna have a little black uh, space in between both our, our jig and that fish, allowing us to really see how tight that fish is to our jig and identify whether he's, he's nosing right up to that bait or if we need to close the distance and try and trigger that bite. Uh, again, if we flip, flip our active screen here over to our 2D sonar, we can do the same thing in our RTS window or our real-time sonar window by tapping menu and flipping our zoom RTS window here over to the A-scope mode. And so now we're running A-scope on both sides and you'll see here, it's just that rounded band and it's really gonna take those stacked colors and make them more identifiable and easier to separate. So when you're fishing those tight schools of fish, um, you're gonna be able to pick out individual fish much easier uh, when the bite is on. So there's a great tip for you, fishing suspended fish or even fish tight to the bottom and really trying to pick them out. Good luck on the ice. This is Matt for Humminbird.